Well, when they invaded this capital on the other side here, broke in, came through one door and nearly smashed through the other almost, and they got in pretty far. Uh, that was scary stuff. In December of 2020, a mob of angry right-wing protesters forced their way into the Oregon State Capitol. It was closed to the public as lawmakers conducted a one-day special session. The group got access when Republican lawmaker Mike Neerman opened a locked door. Everything's changing now, and it's based on making sure that whoever comes into the building is safe and feels safe. Starting Thursday, when anyone enters the building, it will be like going through airport security with metal detectors and x-ray machines. There will also be trained security at each entrance checking for weapons or other dangerous items. Senator Courtney says this is the first time they've had to do this at the Capitol. And here we are starting to join all the other states and sort of limiting access to the people's building. I think that's very sad. And Oregon joins 33 other states who are using metal detectors and x-ray machines at their capitals. And the money for the safety measures comes from the 2021 session where the legislative administration received more than $2 million for these security upgrades. Ashley, Brittany. Brian.